go to sleep. WPC Cartwright informed me that you weren't answering your phone. He's in here, love. <sighs> well, it's not all gold from badminton in Hyde, then, eh? Had a few calls for you, sir. Told them you were all tied up. <laughs> <laughs> you did uh, wash your hands, didn't you? Bad dreams, were they? I've had better. There's Lucy there. She had a diamond with her. <laughs> what? Lysergic acid diethylamide. LSD to you. Better be careful, boss. That stuff lasts for hours. Several pairs of handcuffs missing from stores. <laughs> Anyone any ideas? <laughs> I asked you to look after one of my detainees, sir. Phyllis. I don't recall asking you to sneak her out through the back door, take her home and sleep with her. It wasn't like that. Hey, go easy on him, Phyllis. He's just taking a stroll down a yellow brick road. Where is she now? She was arrested for causing criminal damage. I don't know. His brain functions and heart rate are all up. Racing. It's what we'd expect from a change of medication to pentobarbital. Still, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Do you know who she works for? What? The girl. Do you know who she works for? Yeah, but that's why she came to see me. Don't be a prick, Sam, and don't you go rocking the boat. She's terrified of him. So what? He threatened to rape her and then kill her. Sorry, he what? He threatened to rape her and then kill her. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm glad you find this so amusing. You know, I was the only officer in here who she trusted enough not to hand her over to Warren, so how funny is that? A word. dare come the self-righteous prick with me. I've been working these streets since I was 19 and I'm telling you they're safer now than they've been in a generation. Now if you want to shag the inmates that's up to you but don't you dare chug shit at me or my officers. We're not talking about a dodgy telly. We're talking about threats of sexual violence and murder. You think you know everything don't you? I know the stench of rotten apples. Yeah. And I know your slag is lying through her teeth and do you want to know why? Yeah why? Stephen Warren is a bomb bandit. Do you understand? A puff, a fairy, a queer, a queen, fudge packer, uphill gardener, fruit picking sodomite. It's gay. As a bloody Christmas tree. Mind you, he is a little touchy on the subject, being a twisted Catholic with an elderly mother and all, so I wouldn't go mentioning it to him. You challenged his authority, so he stitched you up like a kipper. 
Pretty girl appealed to your vanity as the only decent sheriff in Dodge City. Slipped you a mickey, tied you up, and bounced on your dingling. Why? Well, I suspect the answer will lie in the post. Photos, you idiot. So, next time I ask you a little favour, I suggest you do it, otherwise your pictures will be landing on the desk of the chief constable. And he gets a Christmas card from Mary Whitehouse. And believe you me, you'll be out of here in the time it takes to say red bloody rum. She's a honey trap. Bingo. You're not the first, and you won't be the last. Checks and balances, Sam. You can't come into our manor throwing your weight around and expect to get away with it. Sit down. Of course not, sir. Look, I'm sorry you had to see what you saw before. Don't flatter yourself. There wasn't that much to see. Main streets or carry on girls? You choose, I'll pay. I don't think so. I can't explain everything. You don't have to explain anything to me. Annie. I've decided something. What have you decided? I'm going to be a really good friend to you. A friend? Because with the enemies you're making, you could do with all the friends you can get. Look after yourself, Detective Inspector Tyler. Please. Annie, please. Hey. I've got to see you naked. It's not all that bad. Give us a minute. What do you want? You're a real class act, aren't you? I do what I have to do. Where are the photographs? Being developed. Please help me. I'm sorry. I was just doing a job. You have a real talent for lying. Some of it was true. This is a dangerous place for you, Sam. And you shouldn't be here. Are you lying to yourself, though? That's the question. Think what you want. You're a loser, Johnny, or whatever your name is, because you live in fear. And that isn't really living at all, is it? No, I don't live in fear. I'm alive. He had it coming to him. You do not humiliate my officers. If you can't keep your people in line, I'll do it for you. I'm the sheriff, Warren. Don't you ever forget it. No, no, Mr. Hunt. You're a bent sheriff. Don't you ever forget that. Tyler, the money, it must have appeared crass and insensitive to you, and I don't think I am, but I know I'm not. You don't think you're what? Crass and insensitive. Oh. You must have thought it was dodgy, hot. It wasn't. Well, it was a little bit, but I gave it back. All of it. That's good, then. I just wanted you to know that I am not 